Today we are going to look at this um, limited edition uh, Princess Elizabeth in uh, Triang Black. It's to uh, celebrate uh, 50 years of the catalogue when it came out, which was um, 2004, I believe. Um, so it's unusual, we never carried this uh, livery. It had delivery with uh, red, stri uh, red lining instead, but never pure black. Um, so yeah, let's go on with the, the review. As we move on to the front of the loco, we have separately applied handrails there and there in silver, you can see the cylinders there too inside. We have a hook, a vacuum pipe, a metal spring buffers, a, yeah, metal spring buffers. We have a metal handrail there, I think the cement parts dart is not separately applied. We also have handrails either side. Now onto the side of the locomotive, um, it's all moulded. That's not bother. We have safety valves and whistles here, separately applied. Handrails separately applied. I think this is reverser, and it's metal too. That's separately applied. There's another little um, mechanism there, separately applied. The badge is printed, but I'm not too fussed. And all the uh, link motion and wheels are all a different colour of grey. You also have the number and the classification on the cab too, with some glazing. There is no cab detail to speak of, it's uh, moulded and it's black. We have the another separately applied handrail there and there, another one down here. I believe this is the late crest, uh, the early crest, I could be wrong. Uh, we have a average colo for the time, it's, you know, it's plastic but it's there. As we move on to the tender, um, it's all moulded again like I said. We have, have moulded steps, we have some rivets as well, forgot to mention that before, we have a metal um, spring buffers. And we have a small um, screw in uh, tension lock coupler, I believe it is. There's also one for the front and some brake rigging in the detail bag. Here is the loco on the tracks. Uh, next up will be um, points test and uh, second radius. It will do second radius because that uh, rear bogey is not fixed, it swings. That's a good thing. So yeah, we've managed that pretty well. Uh, next up is um, slow speed and we'll find it a running partner. It's pretty good for a loco that's uh, been in the box 14 years.
So yeah guys, that's the end of the video. Um, his running partners were the King Stephen over here, uh, random coaches. And in the shed we had the Streamline King, uh, King Henry the Seventh, I believe. And we have the uh, St. Albs, City of St. Albs, I think I said that right. And then over here we have City of Edinburgh Coronation. All old locos, uh, nothing new. Um, yeah, this is a nice, uh, nice loco. Very nice. Um, Livery is plain, but that, if it's a tribute to trying, which I understand it is, then there's nothing wrong in that. Nothing, nothing at all wrong. Um, I know some people disagree. It should have the red lining and the boiler. You know the usual stuff. But um, it never ran this livery, and there was um, I think a Hombi made um, two thousand four hundred or something like that. So yeah, guys, let me know what you uh, think to it. Um, and until next time, guys, it's goodbye from these beauties, and it's goodbye from me.